a non-traded real estate investment trust, also known as a REIT, is a product that takes your money and invests it in real estate. Promoters say this rental income will be sufficient for you to get a sizable annual return. And according to the common sales pitch, after seven to 10 years, the property will be sold and you'll get your money back. You might even get it more if the property is sold for a profit. Hi, I'm Courtney Warning, an investment fraud lawyer at the law firm of Meyer Wilson. Let's talk about why non-traded REITs are an investment you should never make and a recommendation that an advisor should never give. To buy them, you have to pay commissions and fees that often total 15% of your investment and can be difficult to identify. If you want to sell, well, you can't. These things don't have a market and are not traded. That means you have to wait for the promoter to sell the underlying real estate and return your money to you. It can take a decade or more before you see your investment again. Despite the lack of liquidity, the promise of a sizable annual return has enticed many people to invest. The top 20 non-traded REITs held about $67 billion as of the second quarter of last year. In those three months alone, investors put $4 billion more into them. And it's no wonder why brokers love to sell these products. That $4 billion generated about $600 million in fees and commissions for the brokers and their brokerage firms. It also means that only 85 cents of every dollar you invest is actually used to buy real estate. When you invest $100,000, you only own $85,000 worth of the property. That property has to rise 18% in value in order for you to be able to get back the original $100,000 that you invested. If real estate exposure is what you're looking for in your investment portfolio, mutual funds provide investors with professional management with established track records, access to a wide variety of real estate markets, transparent pricing, and ready liquidity. While brokers and advisors may have a good faith basis for recommending that a client make a focused real estate investment, in my opinion, they cannot justify a recommendation to purchase a non-traded REIT. Clients' interests are better served by investments in low-cost and liquid funds managed by individuals with expertise and incentives to construct diversified portfolios of the best real estate investments.